plugging with people who vibe the same as me. I changed my life for things that I wanted and blessings came to me. You can say that I'm way too relaxing and I'm a lame, but we notice that I don't care because there ain't no way I'm ashamed of me. I came from the bottom, no problem, because I've been there before. My lady want to clean up this money, then we gon' share the chore. Ain't no clothes on this policy, it's an open door For anybody strong and ambitious minded for wanting more Trade it fun for some money to stack at different rates Body move the same mind, running much at a different pace Sit alone, smoke till my mental was in a different space Headed out of town, now I catch you niggas on different dates Walk with love and I'm going, so I'll embrace the gates But hoping people love me while living before it get too late Power in my soul and my spirit enhances more of me I'm blessed, but at this moment, more importantly, I'm smoother than before see. All the family that are here in person or coming in later. How we gonna get through this? Because I got another meet that be at, and also we still gotta do uh, big toe. Man, alright. Can we get it? Can we go? Are we ready? Join us on our on a podcast network. You know what I'm saying? Oh man, we just doing it, man. I'm moving too fast for my own self. Oh shit. Let's get it. I forgot. I forgot I didn't have no, you know, the stuff that I usually have. It had clean. I didn't have anything clean. It had nothing clean. You can't, you can't run a network like that. What I ain't got no stuff. <laughs>
Black Airbenders, Eddie Bear, Storm 9000. But fam, we gotta get this on the way. We gotta get it started. So much to do, so little time. Chilling all day. Nah, I ain't mad. I ain't mad. Man, I got it. I had a sleep so good this afternoon. I, somebody woke me up. I was mad as hell. You ever had one of those sleeps? It's just so good. And then somebody just want to wake you up. You like, God damn. I ain't gonna never have another sleep like this. Ever. Ever. You ever had one of those never? You're gonna never have another sleep like this ever. You know, once again, that's Eddie Bear. Storm 9000 Black Air Benders. That is their dedication to Rashawn Roland Kirk called Rashawn. Hotness. Hotness. Let's get it. We just came out of snowstorm. Here we go. Drink your water. Uh, uh, uh. Come on, come on. Drink your water, but first, first, first. Take your breath and drink some water. Take, Take your, your breath. breath. Take your breath and drink some water. Take, Take your breath. breath. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Drink, 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 your nose. drink, drink. Down to your stomach. Do your nose down to your stomach. Or should I say, breathe, breathe, then drink. Take a breath. Take a breath. Take your breath. Now. Grab your glass for some water. Grab your glass. Lift your pitcher of that water. Or a bottle. Get that picture of that water. Uh -huh. Simply pour some water. water. Drink, 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 drink. Drink, drink or should water. I say, lift, pour, then drink. Now move your body and drink some water. Move your body. Move your body and drink some water. Move your body. Move your body and drink some water, what? fam. Just, Just move, move your, your body. body. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should water. I say, move, move, move then your body, drink. Your move your body. Move your body. Now raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Toast. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors, fam. Just raise your glass. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should I say, raise, toast, then drink. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Lift and pour yourself some water. Pour. Move your body, drink some water. Move it. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Breathe, lift, move, toast. But remember to stay healthy. Remember the four pillars. Breathe, drink, eat, move. Drink half your weight in ounces. Eat a culturally appropriate diet. Behave. Take your breath. Come on. Lift and pour. You can do it. Move your body, come on, come, come on, fam. Toast your ancestors, come drink on, it. Get up with me, get that come water. Drink it, drink it, drink it. Come on, you can do it, come on, drink it, lift it, drink it, come on. Drink that health in. Drink, 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 drink. Drink, drink your water. Take your breath. Take your breath, take your breath. Lift and pour. Move your body. Come on, come on. Toast your ancestors. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Drink, 
drink, drink, drink. Oh my come God, on, you come on, drink, drink your water. water. Oh my God. Take your breath. Lift it, pour. Come on, pour it. Move your body. Come on, Move. Move. Family, come on. Toast Move your ancestors. Drink, 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 drink. What? Drink your water. Drink. Drink your water. Family, I am so ashamed. I've been sitting up here having a good time, and I even sent out the the signal to all of the supporters. But it's going on in five, four, three, two, one. It's out. All the supporters should be getting it, but it's about it's about three hundred, two hundred, some are going out. So it's gonna be a minute. Some of them gonna be late, but hey, we ain't got no time. The dawdle or to play. I am running behind time once again. I keep on thinking I got plenty of time, but then I forget that um, I'm assisting with um, another show on the sofa with Dr. Steph. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to be there. Um, as a matter of fact, I don't know if I shared that, but I need to start sharing that on my timeline. You know what I'm saying? A, a real good show. Y'all need to check it out. Um, dealing with all types of issues. She's a doctor. She can help heal. Right? But hey, here we go, family. We're about to hit it. Now, here we go. First off, first off, I wonder, um, it is nothing like standing in the congregation of the mighty, in the home of the stubborn minority, in a place where your hustle builds muscle. This is Giami Journey Media. <laughs> I am your host, Brother Hot Tim. Of course, you know this is a Heart of a Simple production all day, every day. And we want to give all of the money Babies a round of applause. If you're a money Baby or a money Born, go and give yourself a round of applause. You deserve it. Come on, y'all can do better than that. Oh, that was, come on now. Y'all can't give it up. Where's my spiritual audience? There we go. There we go. Give it up to the money Born. We want to lift up our glass to you. We want to salute each and every last one of you. And for those of you that are new to Giami Journey, right to this daily toast or to this moment. We toasting the moment right now, right? We are toasting the moment of Imani. Um, you know, we come here and we do our thing. But the mo major thing that we try to do is we try to blow up those old paradigms. Now, now, just so that you know, just so that you know, the rant for the day is called self-belief, the key to your true potential. Of course, I try to keep it on the tribe, but every now and then I got to go down. You know what I'm saying? Because like I said, the tribe, the, 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 the tribe is composed of individuals, so I got to kind of bring it down, then take it back up, right? Take it down, then bring it up. Take it down, then bring it up. You know what I'm saying? But before we go there, family, we got to talk about it because now I'm hearing... That the masses are, well, I ain't going to say in the masses, the troops are building up over in the Ukraine. And I'm like, yo, fam, um, this is some shit shit. Life as we know it can be changing for as far as America, right? Because America is like, you know, America is at the pinnacle, right? But if Russia um, raised Ukraine, uh, and I told y'all before, if Russia going to Ukraine, I want y'all to be clear of, and watch what happens with China and Taiwan and North Korea and what happens with North Korea and South Korea, I think, right? There's, you know what I'm saying? Because it, this this is this is a lot bigger and we are getting caught up in who Rihanna's baby daddy is. and I mean, it's, it, it's real tribal, big tribal shit going on. A lot of people don't want to call that. See, Russia rolling into Ukraine is some tribal shit. China going to Taiwan is some tribe. It's some tribal beef, right? Nobody want to call that shit. They want to be like, oh, it's countries and blah. No, that's tribal shit. Sorry, you know, the, you know, because a lot of people think you know when you say tribal, you you talking about Native Americans and Africans. No, it's some shit. You know what I'm saying? It's tribal all over this planet. And we got to be aware of that. So, um. What I want to do, I think we have some news to cover. 
I want to get through this real quick. Um, we got some news that we need to cover, so let's go and cover some news real quick. Um, if we could, um, uh, could I get a, could I, uh, we're busting out, we're busting out on the phone. For those that don't know, we got graphics. we're busting out. It's me busting out of a box and right into the news scene. Um, so, um, we got an article that was shared with me. This is from 2020s. It's, it's, it's old. And it was shared with me in actually the Financial Times. And I don't have a, a subscription to Financial Times. Giami, we ain't got our weight up yet to get a, because I don't know if y'all know. When you see somebody getting a Financial Times, right, they breaking bread. The pink paper, right. When you walk through the airport, those of you that have the opportunity to go to the airport, or you got a, a real newsstand or a, a real store with news in there, and you walk by and you see, say, who, what pink paper is that? Why is it a pink? That pink paper is the Financial Times, and that's about 5 to $10 per day. You know what I'm saying? So those people that's getting that. But I found the same article, Unlocking the Life, Saving Secrets of African DNA. And I just wanted to share just a little bit of this article with you. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. So I want y'all to listen up real close to what CNN has to say about what's going on here. Unlocking the life-saving secrets of African DNA. This is from September 26, 2019, actually. But I want y'all to listen to something that they say. This is by Kieran Monk on CNN. All right, you see, you know, you see the, the, the African sitting on the thing right there, and they studying. But in 2006, U.S. scientists published a landmark study that linked the lower levels of gene known as PCSK9 to lower rates of heart disease. Researchers then sought to test the thesis by identifying subjects with a rare mutation that resulted in even lower levels of PSCK9. Just two were discovered, including a young woman living in South Africa. They discovered the gene, and I bet you she ain't getting no money. They took that gene, you know, Henrietta Lack, y'all heard of that? You heard of Henrietta Lack? Yeah. The discovery allowed drug manufacturers to produce what became Prolulent, the first FDA-approved cholesterol-lowering drug. I wonder how much more money, I wonder I wonder how that, that young African is living right now. I wish I had some, wish, wish I had some uh, effects so that I could show. Of, of the 21st century, which would be prescribed to guard against strokes, heart attacks, and other deadly conditions. But check this out. The location of the South African subject was not by chance. There's a greater genetic diversity in Africa than in any other continent studies have consistently shown. Now, this is what I'm... Get ready. You already know it's coming. Get ready. Such variations have the potential to reveal insights and enable development of treatments for health conditions that affect Africans and non-African alike. But scientists say African DNA is being largely <sighs> where my highlighter at real quick. I just I need a highlighter. Highlighter, where you at? Highlighter, come on out. Where my highlighter at? I want my highlighter. Where you at? There we go. But scientists say African DNA is being largely excluded from the field of genomics. Genomics. The study of full gene sets. Uh-oh. So hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now let's go up. So they, they created a landmark drug that was certified by the FDA, right? that came from African DNA because it's the most diverse. But when it comes to studies, right? African DNA is being largely excluded from this field of genomics. What does that mean, Brother Hot Tim? Let's go on, let's go on read a little bit. Lack of gene diversity. Research published earlier this year showed that just, <laughs> highlighter, highlighter, come on, come on highlighter. I, I I wanted to make this show quick. I swear to I swear I wanted to make this show. Uh, 
Um, we need another. We we want to put this in because this is a sissy ass move. Sissy is in sister, you know, because you know we all have sisters that get on our nerves. This is a n nerve rich, you know what I'm saying? For because you got sister people that listen. Sissy ass move. That sister, sissy. That sister that gets on your nerve move. All right. Research published earlier this year showed just 2% of samples used in genome-wide association studies came from Africans, while 78% came from Europeans. Now, and this is where I'm going to stop, this imbalance may be informing the production of treatments that don't work for... I'm going I, I, I'm, I'm to highlight this one in... in um, let's highlight it in green non-European. This imbalance may be informing the production of treatments that don't work for non-Europeans. When people be looking at Brother Hot Tim and they talking about Brother Hot Tim, why don't you do stuff that everybody else do? Right? I hear shit. I've been hearing shit like this for years. I've been knowing stuff like this for years. Right? So, a lot of research and a lot of the genomic or genomic information that they're getting is coming from who? 78% of those that came from me. Which means that their genetic diversity is less. If I am the original, I need to be 78% of the studies because my DNA will affect more people. They are looking at a small genetic pool that might not even might you you might not even be included in that. And you'll be lucky if it affects you. But I ain't gonna tell you where what direction to take that in. Some of y'all, y'all can listen and, and do whatever you want. You go, you can read this article for yourself, and I'm gonna stop right there. I'm gonna stop right there. What you think, anime? Should I stop right there? Spiritual crowd, should I stop? Y'all do your own, y'all do your own research. Now this is from 2019. So I'm quite sure that between 2019 and 2022, they ain't changed that. They ain't changed it that 78%. No, no. I Do I need to trash it? I need to delete it? No, I can't do that. Don't do it, Brother Hot Tim. Go on back. Let's see what else we got in the news so we can keep this moving. I don't think we got nothing else. Uh, yeah, that's all I wanted to share with y'all for now. That's all I wanted to share with y'all for now. All right, so let's keep it moving. Let's go back. We are going to go back. Let's see. And we're going to do uh, the old buildings, you know, old architecture. Let y'all know. Y'all can see some fractals. Y'all get an idea what fractals look like. We are back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. So here we go. What'd you say? Ah, uh, welcome to childhood, baby. It happens to all of us. This is a phase of life where often you are introduced to pain and suffering. So anyway, so family, if we could, anime, baby, if you could set me up so we can go and get this through, get through, because we got to get on up out of here. So here we go. It's the proverb. Uh, proverb. Oh, it's proverb time. Proverb. 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 It's the proverb time. Proverb. Proverb time. Proverb time. Here we go. The proverb of the day. Proverb of the day. This is a good one. Listen, I'm only reading once. When there is a misunderstanding between the left leg and the right leg, the entire body falls. That's the proverb. Tell us, what does it mean? To you, it's the proverb. Oh, proverb. oh man, the proverb. We ain't proverb. Playing here. The proverb. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. All right, all right, all right. Boom, boom, boom. I, I get that. And then also we need we need to move to the next thing. Let's keep it moving because we, you know, I don't I don't want to mess up nothing. Let's go. What time is it? Folk tale, oh! Folk tale, folk tale, folk tale, folk tale, Those of you that got your Challenge, Self Mastery Handbooks, you get that in Guza Saba Challenge dot G and J dot media. That's in Guza Saba Challenge dot G and J dot media. Folk tale for the day, folk tale of the day is a jackdaw 
in the doves. The jackdaw seeing doves in a coat abundantly provided with food, painted himself white and joyed them in order to share their plentiful maintenance. The dove, as long as he was silent, supposed him to be one of themselves and admitted him to their coat. But one day, he forgot himself and began to chatter. They discovered his true character and drove him forth, pecking him with their beaks, failing to obtain food among the doves, he returned to the to the jackdaws. They too not recognize him on account of his color, expelled him from living with them. So desiring two ends, he obtained neither. Damn, that's a good one. I hope you get the message. How many jackdaws we got amongst us trying to act like doves and didn't want to come back once the doves found out that they wouldn't? That sounds... Story sounds kind of wow. Sounds kind of American. Mm. But you know what? That brings us to the next show because I got to think about that. Thinking all the time. Right. Thinking, thinking all the damn time. Anime, if you could get it ready, get it ready, get it ready. Can I get the war on? Oh, man. Oh, man. It is on and popping. I'm about to rant today, family. We are talking about self-belief. We're talking about the principle of Imani. Of course, you know, we're talking about the principle of Imani. And, of course, I wanted to start it off. You know, I got some writing pops, so get your self-mastery journal um, together. Um, but the key to your true potential, self-belief, harnessing Imani in yourself, harnessing Imani in your tribe, is the key to your true potential. Now, but, you know, the, the, the article kind of went more towards the personal, so I'm going to kind of leave it there right now. Iman is the principle of faith, belief, and trust. See, for Giamme, right, in our development, you know what I'm saying, especially working with younger people and running into some some limits, sometimes, you know, certain words is kind of hard for, for kids to understand. It's kind of hard to, to, to demonstrate faith, but it's easier to demonstrate trust. Like you got trust falls. And so these, these are terms that we could use. And it's terms that we could build upon and then move an individual to de being able to deal with the concept of faith. This is probably one of the most important principles because of the foundation from which all things in the world are created. From a concept of this moving that our shade that's basically what faith is about moving that life energy moving that life force into object in, into into other objects moving into projects see a lot of us we come and we work on projects in a zombie like state right no belief we just doing it sometimes we just doing it because we believe we we're supposed to do it sometimes we're doing it because it was the family tradition you know what i'm saying we're not really pouring the energy that is necessary there. And I have seen rituals that were done in earnest in the beginning that just became, in a sense, regular things where people just expected it and the spiritual, the Imani was not being poured into the ritual. And because the Imani was not being poured into the ritual, it just became a thing to do. It became, in many cases, a waste of time because the, the the original core that really felt the ritual no longer were present and that, that faith was not passed on to the next group. You know what I'm saying? It became a, 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 just a thing to do. And we got to be careful that when we are involved in nation building, when we're involved in tribe building, when we're involved in this cultural piece, that we just don't fall into the habit of just doing things. We have to go on and pour the belief in it. I believe every day I have faith. I have money. Money is working with me. That no matter what happens, when I sit down in front of this computer and I push go, I'm, it's popping off. It might take a little bit longer to come out. It might be a little bit uncomfortable sometimes. But I have faith. 
that is going to come out. Why? Because I've been training and I have been practicing. I have been doing things to build up the trust in myself and to build up the money in myself so that I could direct it. And many of us, we have to start being able to do that. This is the key to unleashing our true potential, right? Because many of us, we, we've been taught, we've been taught and, we, and, and the self-belief has been beaten out of us. It's not about me believing in me. It's about, it's about me believing what other people deem that I'm capable of. I need your degree. I need your certification. I need your grading. I need your head nod. When the people become self-sufficient, they start providing that for themselves. They start providing that for their tribes and their families, right? And we don't operate like that right now. We are depending on other cultures and other peoples to present that to us. And once we start learning how to present just that little thing to ourselves, that belief, right? That when, 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 when I receive the nation bitter title, Right. I believe in that title enough that I'm going to do everything that it that it requires me to maintain the respect for that and to get other people to to, to believe in it because they see how I act and how it interacts with me. Imani says, yes, you can. Imani says, yes, I am created to be more than I am now. Yes, I am capable of more than I, what I am doing. Imani says, yes, if I put my mind to it, there's nothing that I cannot accomplish. It's pure belief in self and belief in God. In faith, in self is, um, if faith, and now check this out, if, if faith in self is wrong, please take me to hell. Because a lack of faith in self has led to the destruction of our entire nation and cultures. A lack of faith in self has led to poverty, crime, teen pregnancy, and divorce. A lack of faith in self has caused many people to stop trying and caused them to settle for less than they deserve or are, are capable of achieving. I need you to understand that the belief system starts with a strong sense of belief in yourself. Your belief system starts with a strong belief in yourself. Now, if you're a child, that's a little bit different. Your belief is in your family, your parents. You know what I'm saying? But if your parents' belief is not in them, in themselves, and it's all focused outwards, their money is going all outwards. And the, the place where they're sending their Imani energy, where they're funneling that ashe, is not benefiting them, then the child who has faith in you eventually start believing in those forces that you are focusing on outside. They have more faith in their job than they have in their in, in, in their family. They have more faith in, in, in their job than they have in their people. They have more faith in who's cutting them a check. Right? Who's providing resources. They have faith in that. You know what I'm saying? They have faith in the material. Right? So, one of the things that we need to do is to... I want you to wrestle with some questions because I need you to understand that the belief system starts with a strong sense of belief in yourself. The great among us have always held this philosophy that we are capable of achieving anything we set our minds to. So the challenge for us to figure out is figure out how to point our money in a direction of lifting ourselves and our tribe. Of course, y'all know I have to throw the tribe in there. I got it. You know, how do we lift ourselves? Here are some questions to ask with. Here are the questions. Get, these are writing prompts. Writing prompts. Y'all ready? Come on now. Come on. Get it together. How do you define the money, faith, and trust? What is the story of your faith? Do you feel... I'm sorry. I should have turned this off. Um, I, I, it's still going on. I'm sorry. I, I forgot it was going on. Let me stop that. Do you, do you feel that your culture has influenced your experience with the money? No. Well, first, let's go to what is your story? What is the story of your faith, of your money? Do you feel that your culture has influenced your experience with the money? Do you believe you are capable of more than what you are doing? How do you practice the money in your tribe? Imani is the best way to grow stronger in the face of oppression. 
All right, that the last question, how do you practice Imani in your tribe? Now, here we go. Imani is best is the best way to grow stronger in the face of oppression. Just as our enemies are strong, our strangers are no strangers to oppression, we must also not be afraid of facing it head on. The principle of Imani are, are universal and eternal. Um, they were meant for us and all of those who believe in self-efficacy in the face of oppression. We'll never know if these principles really work unless we try them ourselves. Here are some simple ideas that you can put in place in your personal and tribal life to help you. Have a mission statement. Put together a mission statement for yourself, family. For your tribe. You know what I'm saying? If you got a tribe, sit down. What's the mission statement of your tribe? And do you have a personal mission statement when it comes to lining up with the tribe? Start each morning with Thanksgiving. You know what I'm saying? Not only having faith, but being able to show that gratitude. We talked about that on Ujima, right? Um, start each morning with Thanksgiving. Learn from your mistakes. That means you got to take some time to do some reviewing. That means you need to be journaling. What are some of the things that you can learn from? Eliminate the word I can't or I am. I want you to be careful about that because what you say, I, when you throw that I in front of stuff, especially that I am, right? The I am is a very powerful statement. A lot of people don't understand that. Limit the the word I can't and I am so and so. Be careful what you place I am in front of. All right? Be very careful, right? Pray and meditate often. This can be as simple as um, taking a breath, being aware of your breath. You know what I'm saying? Pray. You know what I'm saying? Talk to your ancestors. Talk to your creator. I mean, whatever your faith is, exercise it. You know, exercise your connection be um, to that thing that's that's higher than you, right? And and look for responses. You know what I'm saying? Use your reticular formation to be looking for it, right? If you if you are a cultural person, your 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 how can I put it? Your 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 higher power will communicate with you through your culture. Six and last, connect in real time. Connect with people in real time, not text time, call, or smoke break time, but real time face to face. You never know what you're missing out on, how your words and tones affect people and how their words and tones affect you. All right. So anime, I'm done right now. So family, hopefully you got something out of there. Warhorn, please. Thank you. Thank you. Be good. I'm thinking, I'm thinking all the time as we send GMA. Class dismissed. I get the hell up out of my classroom. But now, here we go, family. We're about to move to this toast real quick. Let's get it. Um. Okay. Matter of fact, y'all going to listen to the players for a second. I got to do something. I got to handle some business real quick. Got some business. Minute by minute. Minute, minute by minute. minute. Hour by hour. Hour by hour. You lose your history. You lose your history. You lose your power. You lose your power. power. Minute by minute. Minute, minute by minute. minute. Hour by hour. Hour by hour. You lose your faith. You, you lose, lose your faith. You lose your power. You lose your power. If it is to be, it's up to me. If it is to be, it's up to me. I feel good about myself. I feel, I feel good, good about, about myself. myself. I feel good about the people around me. I feel, I feel good, good about, about the people around me. I feel good about I feel good about the people around me. 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 For the rest of my life, and you will follow me for the rest of my life. Cause I walk with good, cause I walk with good, and I talk with good, and I talk with good, and I am good, and I am good, and that feels real good, and that feels real good. Good, better, best, good, better, best. Never let it rest, never let it rest. Until your good is your better, and your good is your better, and your better is your best, and your better is your best.
get your help drink. Those that are new to Jeremy Journey, we start off with the water and the movement, right? And the toast. And then we bring it down. At the end, we always use a health drink. We got our health drink right here. Um, we are lifting up our toast and we are saluting the creator by whatever name you choose to call it creator. We're lifting up our glass and we say, Ashe. Man, family, we're going to move. We're moving to lift up our personal ancestors, which we do every morning at 5.45 a.m. 5.45 a.m. Um, every morning. Eastern Standard Time, you come join us where we toast and lift up our ancestors. Family, um... Those that want to get their ancestors on the list, join the email list, and you can correspond with us. And in corresponding, you can let us know who your ancestors are. We just ask you to be mindful that there's other people that got ancestors they want to add to the list. So be mindful of how many you, you send us. We lift up our glass. We say, Ashe. Family, we lift up our glass. We move to what we are here for. We're here for the present moment. Family, we are in a moment of faith. We lift up our glass to Imani. We lift it up and we lift it up high. We lift it up powerfully. We ask you to open up your reticular formation to seek out Imani. Family, I ask you and I want you to remember that for those that don't speak the language, Imani means faith. Um, the modic principle for the day is harmony. The M7 for the day is trust. The color is red, as you can check by my shirt. Gender is the hermetic law. Male name is Kwesi, female name is Akusua. We lift up our glass, we salute the power this moment, and we say, Ashe. And family, we lift up our glass for our children, our children's children, on to infinity, and we say, Ashe. From there, family, we lift up our glass to all those who need that balanced healing energy. Family, we lift up our glass, we got Brother Kwesi Low. Right, we lifting up our glass to him. We lifting up our glass to Elder Tony West. We lifting up our glass to Elder Debbie Bowie. We lift up our glass. We salute and we say Ashe. <laughs> Last but not least, family. We started with the we in, we started with the cray. We end with the cray. We lift up our glass. I got my Phoenix egg today. Miss Gina ain't joined us today. She upstairs getting ready for school tomorrow. We lifting up our glass. We salute and we say Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Family, wish you peace, power, joy, and 100 years. And as we said, Jamie Cat in, because this is our thing. And of course, you know, too black. All right. So, family, we are out. Y'all have a great and marvelous day. Um, take us out nice and easy. Um, anime, please. If you could, baby. Anime? Anime!